uh, Susan here and um, thought I'd give you a little walk through with the uh, Ego cam, extreme sports cam uh, by Liquid Image. So I'll, I'll give you a walk through and show you how to connect it to your phone uh, through the app that's available for free from Google Play Store or Apple iTunes and uh, get it connected and, and set up your your settings for your camera so first off it's hooked to my um, RC vehicle so I'm just gonna do it from here um, but first off you have to start the camera there you go and you have to wait till the Wi-Fi signal flashes in the uh, viewer there um, before you can hook it up to your phone. It takes about 17 seconds to trigger uh, to, to be accessible. And we have an Android phone, so we went and got the appropriate app from the Google Play Store. But first off, you have to set up the Wi-Fi. So you go to System Settings, go to your Wi-Fi, now on the camera, you press and hold this button here uh, for there two two beeps. Um, that's the, uh, the the shutter button, two beeps, and the Wi-Fi should go solid. So now you scan. Oh, see, it's found ego connected. So now you can back out of there. Go back to your home screen. And you go to your app that you've downloaded. Now we've put it in a camera programs folder. And you go to liquid image right here. Okay, spins it sideways. getting the file list which means it's found the phone uh, for found the camera there you go so it's already showing the camera <laughs> that's my husband's hand <laughs> okay so we go to the gear setting here getting camera status okay you go to there's video format we want to go to 1080p okay uh, photo resolution you get 12 12 megapixel 5 or 3 we'll just leave it at, at 12 uh, security you can uh, choose a password and apply it so that it secures your connection um, we're not anywhere we have to worry about that right now so we're just going to leave that for now um, camera info it shows you all the info on the camera um, the model number the firmware number everything okay auto exposure now you get night scene landscape portrait or automatic we're doing auto um, because it, it adjusts for the brightness um, of the area you're shooting in so that's all good okay hit the gear icon again and you're back to the what the camera sees and uh, if you just hold on for a second we'll be right back with some driving footage to give you a, a first a person view of what's happening here now what i would like to mention um before i go here is when you trigger this through the camera uh, through the phone to trigger it to start recording it will cut off the wi-fi signal so you can't keep watching first person it will cut it off but the camera will take up the recording and uh you'll see it after that but anyway um, we'll be right back with some driving footage 
here we are in the parking lot and uh, give you some uh, footage from the cam itself and uh, I'll just shut up for now and you can watch the driving. Okay, bring it back in now, and to shut this down, uh, to, to save the recording, etc., you simply press this shutter button, and turn the camera off. And there you go. Okay, uh, and uh, the footage of the camera will be attached to the end of this video. Uh, so you can see it, what it captured. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.
to, to save the recording, etc., you simply press this shutter button. Turn the camera off.